decided when delivery truck driver Gary D'Angelo thinks of how he's going to spend his millionaire winnings, he doesn't picture fancy cars or big screen TVs or even new golf clubs. No, no, no. Gary just has one thing on his mind, his beautiful wife, Christina, who's in the audience with his mom. Welcome to both of you. And nice to see you, Gary. Yeah. So what do you mean? You don't want cars, TVs, golf clubs, just something for Christina. What would that be? My wife and I eloped, and um, really, this is kind of a surprise, but we never really had a chance for a honeymoon. How and long have you been married? Ten years. Okay, ten years. And I would like to surprise her with some nice trip somewhere. Oh, that's very nice. <laughs> so, Christina, where would you like to go? Since we have two kids, I just have a sneaking suspicion it might end up being Disneyland or something <laughs> with the kids. No, it's got to be more romantic than that, don't you? Even though I it's, love Disneyland. A, we're going Hawaii to Disney World nice. to also, but that's See, for I just the heard kids. her say Hawaii. All right, she's All right. the boss. All it's right, good. Her, you know? <laughs> if you want to go to Hawaii, which Christina does, we got to get working here yeah, because you have 4000 You're eight away. Okay from the million dollars and the best news of all you have all three lifelines sitting there you get to the $25,000 mark and you will get the switch to question and I hope that you walk away with this Capital One check for one million dollars that would be the best news of all so what do you say are you ready to play let's play audience are you ready to play right. let's play millionaire <laughs> all right Gary this is for eight thousand dollars what u.s state has the longest coastline florida california new york alaska oh. california's pretty long florida does that up and around thing but alaska's huge um, going to ask the audience. All right, audience, Gary needs your help. If you're ready, vote now. Okay, 71% believe it is Alaska. Then Florida, California, nobody thought it was New York. <laughs> I will side with these fine people who want my wife to go to Hawaii <laughs> and say Alaska final sure final answer I thought it was Florida it's Alaska you have it Smart, you guys. I thought it was Alaska too, you know. Yeah, right. I'm sorry, Gary. That's right. Right after I, I thought Florida and California. <laughs> Going for sixteen thousand. In two thousand six, what religious leader made the dubious claim that when he was nearly seventy three, he could leg press two thousand pounds? Billy Graham, Jerry Falwell, Pat Robertson, Jimmy Swagger. When he was nearly 73. Okay, I gotta take the commas out of here. I gotta look at the basins. In 2006, when he was nearly 73. Does that mean he was nearly 73 in 2006? And does that information help me? I don't think so. I do have a feeling. And what's that? Feeling is I better use the 50 50. Okay. <laughs> Computer, please randomly take away two of the wrong answers. Now, is the one you were thinking of? Or? It is, but that other guy's done some sketchy things, too, so... Ah, <laughs> uh, boy. Uh, C. Pat Robertson. Final? Yes, it is. You got it for $16,000. <laughs> 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 I 
I hope I can do that when I'm 73. <laughs> See the $25,000 question. Spoken by a character named Bonacera, the first line of The Godfather is, I believe in what? Vengeance, America, family, honor. Uh, those guys believe in all of those things. Did you see the movie? Yeah. yeah. I think I'm gonna call my friend whom I like to call Spartacus. Spartacus? Yes. <laughs> and he likes to call me that too. It's a weird thing. And nobody else calls either of us that, but. I don't think you should share that with a lot of people. <laughs> <laughs> too late. It is. Spartacus, all right? His name's Dave. I uh, know. His name is Spartacus. We're going to get Spartacus okay. on the line. <laughs> Let's call Spartacus. Hello? Hey, Spartacus? Yes. Hey, it's, it's <laughs> Meredith from Millionaire. How you doing? Good. You're not wearing a tunic or anything, are you? No, nothing like that. Okay. You know, I'm <laughs> Only <here>. on Saturday. <laughs> well, I'm here with Gary, the other Spartacus in your life, <laughs> and he needs your help. All right. I'm here. He's going for $25,000. Great. All right, Gary, you have 30 seconds and your time starts now. Spoken by a character named Bonacera. The first line of The Godfather is, I believe in what? Vengeance, America, family, honor. 19 seconds. Could you read those again, please? Vengeance, America, family, honor. First line of The Godfather. America. I believe in America too, Spartacus. That's it. All right, man, you sure? Yes. Right, thank you, dude. All right. How did you guys end up with this nickname, Spartacus? We used to do these weekend canoe trips. All of a sudden, it sounds like a weird story, but it's not. <laughs> it, it sounds like Brokeback Mountain. Remember we this? <laughs> That's what it sounds like. Hey. <laughs> but uh, what do I know? This what is a family show. <laughs> We yeah. were talking about movies. Oh, uh, and you. And we both did the I am Spartacus line. Oh, okay. And Speaking it just of lines? Stuck. It stuck, but only with the two of us. And he did say America. Correct. Spartacus said America. I said he was sure. How could you not trust a guy like Spartacus? <laughs> I'm going to go with B, America, because Spartacus would never do me wrong. Final answer. He is your man. You got it. Gary has twenty-five thousand, and that fourth lunch line will be right back there.